Do I make a behind the scenes video? Mm. Yeah, that'll be good. Yeah. Which, which language do you want to use? English. English, okay. Yeah. Hmm? Behind the scenes video. Piles of stuff. Having our morning tea. There seems to be a uh, slight shower. Better not keep up. It's not going to be too fun. Alright, here we go. Take a seat. Well, we have arrived at the trailhead. As you can see, there is a uh, definite drizzle occurring. Alright. I'm going to be heading out here. Wonderful. Wunderbar. Infusion. Do not have to look at the wine, how it's parked with. Here we go. Got the gear. We got ourselves. Most importantly, we didn't forget that part. It's pretty vital. These sort of things. Oh, there he is. You saw me sleeping, guys? Is it super slow just sitting there? <laughs> That is Bumblebee. Here's the biggest stream on the way up or down as well, I guess. It's pretty uh, depleted at this point, being late in the summer. We have located a uh, good spot of berries. They're pretty, uh, pretty thick here. So we will pick some Dance. into our mugs. Look at that. Okay. Check out the views. We have attained 6,040 feet of elevation. That means about 400 more to go to the lake out of 2,000. You can see the lower Beehive Lake. That looks really pretty. There's a Roman Nose Peak over there. So we have come to the lake. They're a very familiar lake. Very awesome trees. Midget trees. Lunch time. Cool thing about this awesome grass and moss is that you can go barefoot. <laughs> oh yes. Feels like heaven. Well, probably work with speaking. So we've discovered this patch of uh, flowers that have these bumblebees in them that are in a uh, parallel dimension or something. Where time is super slow because uh, they're moving really, really slowly. I mean, they're working, but they're working really slowly. <laughs> Shall I dethrone you? <laughs> no. Imagine if I just rolled off into the water right now. I'm saying, we're gonna make that reality. <laughs> no. Look at this little island. <laughs> Eugene shall venture it. <laughs> You're like Britain over there. Oh, good, bro. Huh? You gonna cut that out? Huh? Cut it out. <laughs> Mosquitoes. <laughs> Just yeah. Um, th this is what I call uh, overcrowding. You know, planets. If this was our planet. Then I'd call this over overcrowding. If you look at what we have here to ourselves, this Earth definitely ain't overcrowded. That's right. This marmot lives here, apparently, because I saw him last time. <gasps> Where is he? There he is. He's just like, hey, you guys, what are you guys doing here? And Gene's gonna go try to converse with him. Sitting here. You want Having you, our tea. Why aren't you eating any of these huckles? Uh, they're too far away. A couple huckleberries? <laughs> Two.
two, three. Tastes like Russian candy. That's a good thing. Eugene has um, <clears throat> acquired his toothbrush. And uh, I gotta find mine. I'm thinking about this one right here. Yeah, it may be a little bit too small, but we'll see. Here we are, getting ready for a fire. It's 7 o'clock. Trying to get in bed around 8, maybe a little bit later. Dinner is going to be had. Beef stew. Fireside dinner. Mosquitoes, please let me have my dinner in peace. Get out of here. So, time for an awkward dark video. All I can hear is a clogged up nosy voice. Um, yeah, we're in bed. It's like, what time is it? Let's see. 8.52. Yeah. The rain is kind of starting up here. Hopefully it stops before the night's over. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And tomorrow hopefully it'll be a clear day. God willing. <laughs> well, we'll see you in the morning. Here it is. 7.30 in the morning. We've gotten up. Uh, weather's actually not that bad. Partly cloudy. Not raining. It's always good. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna make some tea and breakfast. And start doing things. Treachery. Some mouse. Decided it was gonna eat our breakfast for us. It's like half of it's gone. Little bugger. Ate all right to the side of his bag. We had our breakfast, and now we're uh, heading up to one of the peaks up there. Following the stream again. At the quiet can this time. Quite characteristic to alpine areas, you find out just snow at the end of, well, like mid. Mid August. There's a lot of snow here still. Pretty thick. Here we are on top of the smaller little peak here. It's pretty cool. Yeah, down there there's a lake. Nice little breeze up here. And then there's that peak we're thinking to go up there somehow. Yeah, this is the best thing to do. Find a whole, an overhanging rock, sit on it, and take in the unabridged views. <laughs> Perfect solitude. Nobody else here. Let's come out here and praise God. Sort of sitting on a slow outcrop by some pretty sheer rocks. Pretty vertical, basically. Trying to find a way to get to the top of this mountain up there. Just a bit sketchy sometimes. I've been using more rock climbing holes than I would have liked. But whatever. We'll get up there. I think we're almost there. But yeah. That looks kind of steep. Well, we'll see. Gotta get it there somehow. Here we are at the top of this peak. U.S. Geological Survey stamp. Mm -hmm. the elevation, 7,607 feet. Pretty cool view from here. You can see everything all around. And this big bowl here. There's Chimney Rock, right over there, that's pretty cool, and then just more stuff over there, there's Priest Lake. Here's this cairn that uh, my friend Mark and I built on our previous trip. We've descended the mountain, and uh, at the back of the lake now, heading back to camp. 
have probably some lunch. Maybe get a swim. It's gonna be fun. Where are you going? We've donned our huh? swim apparel. Time to go swim. I'm going right in there. Okay. Ready? Down we go. What? Yeah. What? It's good. It's definitely not that very cold. It's probably like 45. It's pretty cold. Degrees. Hmm? It's probably like 45 degrees. Mm, it's pretty cold. It's not like uh, <laughs> not like the lakes at home. Look at this panorama behind. Lunch time. That's always a good good choice. Chilling. Yep. Right here on the grass. Fire number two. It's the last fire of the of the trip. Finishing our cider. Here. I'm gonna go to bed. Yes. Morning number two. Um, eight o'clock. Oh, no, a little bit later. Gotta get up, eat our breakfast, and uh, start packing up. Hold on. Oh, the mosquitoes are already awaiting our exit. Breakfast. We got some uh, sea deals, as uh, Adrian called them. <laughs> Should be good. Thanks, uh, thanks, Adrian from the West Coast Trail. Got some raspberries in there, almonds, and then some coffee. And we should be on our way. Pack up the tent. Hopefully, it doesn't start raining too much. Well, the rain has now achieved a steady gait. <laughs> Pretty well. <laughs> it's pretty well overcast. And yeah, it's gonna be fun hiking back down in the rain. And packing the tent's gonna be fun too. Ah, behold, the mist descends. This is truly awesome, I think. Although you cannot see the full beauty of it, but it's awesome. You can see like, the, the clouds rolling down and into here. Ah. Ah. The mist does call for a pun. It's quite mystical.